Hi everyone! For today's dairy free review, I have Daya cheese. I got the mozzarella shreds. They also make cheddar shreds and pepper jack shreds. And they have wedges, which are like blocks of cheese, so you can slice them or use them in different ways. Um, this is an 8 ounce package. It says 2 cups, and I paid $4.99 at Wegmans for this. I've also seen it at Whole Foods. Now, I really like this product, um, but let me give you two disclaimers. One is I haven't eaten cheese in many years. And two is I've tried several vegan cheeses and they're all disgusting. And I'm not saying that they're bad because they don't taste like cheese. I'm saying they're bad because they don't taste good at all. Um, and I had kind of sworn off vegan cheeses. I kind of tried to pretend there's no such thing as cheese. Um, but uh, this came highly recommended to me. And this product's actually used in some um, vegan restaurants. So it's obviously a high quality ingredient. And I gave it a try, and considering I had zero expectations, I was pleasantly surprised. I tried the mozzarella first, and I liked it well enough to try the cheddar. Um, I have not yet repurchased the cheddar, but I have gotten the mozzarella several times, so a little bit less impressed with the cheddar, but the mozzarella is pretty good. I'll give you a look at the ingredients and the nutrition. Feel free to pause the video if you need to take longer to read this. And considering this is a fake cheese food product, it's actually um, surprisingly not so scary ingredients in there. I'll give you a look at the nutrition as well. Now I use this on pizza and grilled cheese sandwiches, and I'll put a little bit on top of some pasta dishes. Um, this is definitely something that you're going to want to melt or cook in some way. Uh, it says here for pizza, lasagna, nachos, quesadillas. And having a vegan cheese that melts is kind of um, kind of a new thing. Most of the other vegan cheeses, the texture is just off, it doesn't melt, it just doesn't act like cheese, whereas this does. So um, right here it says melts and stretches and that's kind of its, its claim to fame. And this is what it looks like straight out of the packaging. And I like this product and I'm so grateful that it's available to me, but to be honest with you, straight out of the package it's less than appetizing. The shreds are kind of like foamy or springy and they're pretty greasy um, but once they're melted it, it changes them and they're, and they're a lot better. I'm going to use this tonight on some pizza so I'll give you some clips of how that turns out. My final verdict is I do really like this product. Uh, I think I'm always going to be a little bit sad that I can't eat real cheese um, but this product helps make me a little bit less sad. If you have any dairy-free products that you'd like for me to review in the future, please leave a comment down below so that I can keep my eye out for them. And thank you so much for watching.